Hi, has this ever happened to you? You buy a new product, you have great hopes for it, and then you start using it, and what happens? It doesn't work. Well, that's what's happened to me with Sony Vegas Movie Studio Platinum 12. I try to do a particular thing, and it stops working. I'll demonstrate that in a moment, but just to prove that I have the right hardware, I'm going to show you my hardware screen. As you can see, I have an HP system that's got an i7 processor and 14 gigabyte of memory. And I've got the 64-bit Windows 7 operating system installed. So I think I have all the hardware bases covered. So now I'll demonstrate what happens with Movie Studio Platinum 12. Normally to insert text, you just go up to the text track or insert a text track click right click and go down to insert text media a box will pop up like this one you go in and change your text you click on the X and normally when you move your mouse over the box you'll be able to see the text up here but in movie studio platinum 12 when you click on the box you get this movie studio platinum has stopped working details about this problem can be collected and reported to sony creative software for troubleshooting well i've done that and what i don't understand is they had a similar problem to this in version eleven i believe that was fixed so i don't understand why they're still having this problem in version twelve in version eleven there was a workaround and I'll show you that workaround, only I'll show it to you in the current version, version 12. We'll see if it works the same as it did in version 11. Okay, so again, we're in version 12. So we right click, and instead of insert text media, we're going to select insert generated media. And we go down to legacy text, we double click on that, and then we have a very similar screen as to what we had in the other one and we can uh, put some text in there and we'll see what happens okay so far so good it hasn't died yet let's just click on the text box oh looky there it died so again I I'm frustrated that a brand new version comes out and it has a problem similar to what it had in the previous version. So if anyone has any workarounds, I'd love to hear it. Thanks a lot.